But everybody, that means hello in Armenian and yes, you've guessed it right, I am in Armenia right now and today my mission is to convince you to come and visit this compact, beautiful land in the heart of the Caucasus. Over the last few years, as its neighbours Georgia and Azerbaijan grew in popularity as travel destinations, Armenia remained the quietest of the three and yet it may just be the most surprising. Armenia is home to only 3 million people, a third of whom live right here in Yerevan. Armenia is also a great destination for culture and history junkies. Not many people know, for example, that it was the very first country in the world to adopt Christianity as its state religion. My next reason for you to visit Armenia is for its wine. This actually happens to be one of the oldest winemaking regions in the entire world. The rolling hills of Armenia have provided fertile soil for grape production for millennia. But there's one more thing about Armenia I need to tell you about, and that is its nature. Probably the highest concentration of totally diverse landscapes I've seen anywhere and plenty of adventures to go with them. The best thing about the Armenian outdoors is that they are practically untouched. With so little tourism here, there's a sense of nature at its most pristine anywhere you go, be it mountain, forest or lake. It really makes you smile in awe at this small gem in the heart of the Caucasus.